This is an addendum to a video I made not long ago on shooting a G1000 approach and I've been asked to demonstrate shooting an approach where you have a uh, procedure turn that is a course reversal. So I'm heading from the northeast to Coleman Young Memorial Kilo Delta Echo Tango to the ILS runway 33 and transition YQG. So I've already activated the approach and we're about 8 miles out. And I'm cruising at 3,500 feet, so we stay under the Class B veil at Detroit. So right now we're about four and a half minutes from GOMAC. Now after we pass YQG, our next waypoint is GOMAC, and that's at 3,000 feet. So I'll begin a, about a 500 foot per minute descend to 3,000 feet. And once we level off at GOMAC, our next waypoint will be the actual hold or the procedure turn. And we'll be at final altitude until we get to VQ, which is our final approach fix at 1800 feet. So there really isn't anything for us to do until we get to the final approach fix. And at that point, the GPS should transition to the localizer, and then we'll just ride the beam down. So we've leveled off now at 3,000 feet, and we're just a little more than a minute away from the procedure turn. So we're entering the course reversal now, and we'll just watch the autopilot do its magic. And in this case, the autopilot is using a teardrop procedure to do the reversal. And of course, there's no altitude changes here, so we're staying at 3,000 feet. And of course the holding pattern is really just a protected area and the FAA doesn't care what kind of turn you do inside there so the autopilot is free to choose whatever procedure it wants to. And of course you can see that racetrack pattern on the approach plate. And we'll be lining up on a heading of 328, which will be right in line for the localizer. Now one interesting thing to point out is on this approach plate, which comes from SkyVector, is the latest uh, approach plate. And of course I'm using the older ones. And so this final approach fix, VQ, does not show up on this approach plate, but obviously uh, it's in my flight plan and we'll be hitting that at 1800 feet. So we're lining up on the final approach course to head straight into GOMAC and then on down to the final approach. So now we're about a mile away from GOMAC, so I'm going to move ahead in the video. Uh, we're about 30 seconds from GOMAC now, and we're about 2 minutes from BQ, which is our final approach fix. 
So we should be getting localizer capture any second now. And there it is. So I'll set the autopilot in approach mode. And all that's left to do now is just to ride the beam down, kick off the autopilot when we get close, do our landing. Minimums, 